This video is proudly sponsored by Cameron Hoskin TV, one of the young artists at the forefront of British rising talent. Cameron covers the latest songs with a blend of some of his favourite classic pop tracks and even releases some originals sometimes. Cameron is working towards releasing his debut album, so what are you waiting for? There's lots to find out and lots to discover, so head straight over to his channel after this video to help support his singing dreams for the future. Check the description below for links to find him all across the internet, everything you could possibly need. Thank you to Cameron for supporting me by sponsoring this video. I'd appreciate you checking his videos out too. Thank you. Taylor and I watch Ask the Teen on Teen Talks. <laughs> Enjoy! Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Ask the Teen. This week's Ask the Teen is episode number 86. Hope you really liked the intro last time. I had so many lovely comments from you all, so thank you very much. Sorry about the camera, I was testing out a new one, back to the normal one this week, but for another new one in a few weeks' time, more news about that on my Facebook page if you follow me over there. If you don't, you don't know what's going on. But uh, anyway, so back to the normal camera, but I have got a new tripod this week, which is why you're a bit higher than usual. Hope you're not too high and you're not getting kind of like scared up there. Anyway, on to the questions. Sky Rosalia asks me if you had the power to control time, which year would you go back to? Well actually, if I had the power to control time, I wouldn't be going back at all. I'd probably go forward to like the year 4000 and see how different it is to what we got now. Or if I could control time, I'd probably stop it. No, I didn't really stop it, I'm still going, I was just being still. Okay, that didn't work at all, next question. The Random Pasta asks me, what is your favourite song at the minute? Well, there's loads of songs I like at the minute. I mean, Carly Rae Jepsen's Call Me Maybe is still amazing. But my favourite song at the minute is probably Shane Dawson's The Vacation Song, or Calm In Broken Hearted. I've loved Calm In For Ages, I love their new song, but now that Broken Hearted is finally on UK radios, I just love listening to it. And The Vacation Song really gets me in the mood for a YouTube summer, so really cool. So Mr. Ben175 asks me, will you be watching or going to any of the Olympic Games? No, I won't. No, don't worry, I will be watching it really, but I'm not going to any of them. Anyway, so Alan Day Official asks me, if you had the opportunity to, would you go on Big Brother? Well, because obviously I've been talking about it the last few weeks, and he was thinking, so you talk about it, you don't seem to like it, but would you go on it? Well, I'd love to go on Celebrity Big Brother, even though I'm not a celebrity, and I think that'd be quite cool. But to go on Normal Big Brother, I don't know that I'd be able to be stuck in there two months, not that I think I'd win, I'd probably go out the first week, so we'll take that as a yes. So now it's time for the part of the show that is called the one and only The News Talks. And this week, unlike the last few, I've only got two things to talk to you about, it's a bit quieter this week, so if you've got topics for next week, let me know down there. It always helps to get some of your feedback of what you'd like to see. Anyway, so the first one is Mariah Carey's comeback is coming, which is kind of the idea of a comeback. She's coming next week. Uh, it's called Triumphant. Get them, her new single. So make sure to go and get them or get a copy of Triumphant if you want to. Are you looking forward to her comeback? Do you like Mariah Carey? Apparently she's going to be on Idol, as I talked about last week. What do you think? Have you heard the song yet? Have you seen the video yet? Let me know down there. Second topic for this week is, of course, the one and only Al City is releasing his new single, Good Time, Fee Carly Rae Jepsen, and the video came out this week. Now, originally, according to Kylie Rae Jepsen, the video was coming out the same day as today, or this video, Thursday. But according to Our City's trailer, it's coming out on the Tuesday. So I obviously believed Our City, and he was obviously right, because what does Kylie Rae Jepsen know? She's too busy kind of having a bit of fun and asking people to call her maybe. But anyway, so the point is, the video's out. Have you seen it yet? What do you think? Do you like the song? Let me know down there. What are we with all the arms today? Anyway, now it's time for the team stop time. Now it's time for the teens top 10 where I count down your favourite 10 artists of the week rather than your top 10 songs. So it's unique to this chart show. So make sure to vote for your favourites next week and make sure they're at the top in the description section below my sponsored information you can find a link. And if you follow that link it will take you to where you can vote. So let's find out if your favourites are in my chart this week. At number 10 she'll be in La La Land if you get her to number 1 it's Demi Lovato. Number 9 J-Ho it's J-Lo. Number 8, One Direction Want One Thing, it's the number one spot, but they're at number 8 in the minute. Number 7, He'll Be Your Boyfriend if he gets to number one, it's Justin Bieber. Number 6, She's Pounding That Alarm when she gets to number one, it's Nicki Minaj. Number 5, as I said already, She Will Love You Like A Love Song, and who says you can't be number one, Selena Gomez says because she wants that spot. Number 4, She's Going To Be Partying All Night, or should I say all last Friday night, if she gets to number one, it's Katy Perry. Rita Ora will kill you, RIP, if you don't get to number one. 
Number two, Cameron Hoskins holding strong. Well done to him. And finally, again this week, the number one spot goes to Sarah Gibson. You girls really like her, don't you? And so do you guys. So make sure to keep voting for her if you like her or for others if you want them at number one. And we'll see who gets there next week. Thank you for watching. Make sure you're voting and let's get on with the show. So a bit of a change around in the chart, but my number one and my number two are still the same as they have been the last few weeks. Well done to our YouTubers who are holding strong in the chart, but I wonder if anyone will ever replace them. So anyway, thank you for watching another episode of Ask the Scene. If you'd like to check out my shout out this week, it goes to Nerd Jam. He's been a long term follower of mine. I know him in real life as well. Haven't seen him in a long time time but he's really cool and worth checking out so go check out his videos i call him uh the charlie is so cool like of small youtubers so make sure to go and check him out he's really funny thank you for watching another episode of ask the scene if your question weren't answered leave another one down there and i'll be sure to answer it soon if you want to shout out next week down there too if you've just got general comments want to talk to me down there too or send them to me as an inbox message you've got my facebook the teen talks my twitter greg frog and my second channel the teen two all up there so make sure to check them out as well and i will see you next time please subscribe up there it means so much to me and there's lots of pointing this episode has already said Said. Thank you, and I'll see you next time. Bye for now, everyone.